Congratulations, great red carpet night premiere for Reagan. How does it feel for being here tonight? It's exciting. It's taken four years since we started filming this movie. We never thought we would make it here. It's an incredible night and I'm so honored to be here. I'm so excited. So many of the actors from our film are here. Um, we just never imagined that we would finally get here and we are here. So I'm really grateful and I'm excited for people to see the movie. So what initially drew you to this project? Well, I'd heard that it was being made, and I kind of was a little bit excited about the thought that maybe I could play Nancy Reagan, as scary as it was. I was very nervous about playing her. Obviously, she's a very iconic, famous figure, and I thought, like, am I up for the task? But I thought, that's my job as an actor, is to embody and create different characters, and maybe ones that people wouldn't expect. So I was, you know, I was up for the challenge, so I hope it worked out. I was going to say, that is a very challenging thing, especially playing someone that there was like so many videos of oh, that person. Everybody's going to compare me, obviously, and I just thought the most important thing is that if I can channel her essence and capture and embody her spirit and read as much as I could, read her memoir, which I did, talk to people that knew her, find out as much as I could about her, then I could hopefully embody her, even if I don't look exactly like her, sound exactly like her, but the wigs and the costumes and the makeup were really, really important. Um, but I wanted to capture her, you know, flaws and all, not a perfect human, we're all human, nobody's perfect, but I just wanted to, not, we didn't want to do caricatures, you know, we didn't want to do impersonations, so. Now, usually I ask everybody about the legacy of Ronald Reagan, I'm going to ask you, the legacy, what legacy should we remember of Nancy Reagan? Nancy was a very powerful woman, and I think people sometimes misunderstood her. Obviously, you know, she, uh, cared about how she dressed and how she looked, but in the end of the day, she was completely her husband's rock, and she was the backbone to him, and she supported him and loved him so deeply, and I think without that love that they had for each other, I don't think he would have been president of the United States, so I think that there's something very noble and honorable about a woman who helps somebody become more confident and believe because she believed in him I think he believed in himself and I think that's a noble thing well said well said hey re really appreciate you uh, speaking to us and before I let you go I want to say my camera woman here yeah. her name is Nancy and named oh, after I Nancy, your head. Nancy, Nancy yeah. Reagan too really amazing oh my god oh that's incredible wow well nice to meet you Nancy <laughs> the real Nancy all right take care